sorry. I'm so sorry. I love you so much. I love you so much. It's good to hear your voice again. Kept you in the dark. Try to save her. I couldn't. You don't have to say it anymore. Hotman. You need to fix his cupid. I couldn't save our child, but you can save our world. Only you. I love you. You hear me? Forever. And always. Now, make the world whole. Okay? Just like you make me. All that she went through, I had no idea. I thought, I thought she'd severed our bond on purpose, that she stole our child and ran. I fixed your cupid like she asked. Limiter should be functioning properly now. There is one thing. Before I sat down to work, I took a long, hard look at the code. I'm pretty sure someone's tweaked it. Either that, or my memory's going to pieces. Someone rewrote your code? Rewrote might be overstating it. Let's just say it wasn't the latest version I released. And yet, because of it, I was finally reunited with Malingan. Could be we found our culprit already. She died beneath the rubble, with our child still inside her. Her car passed over to the other side, but her ha remained bound to our dead daughter. She knew all of this, of course. That's why she kept one cuff loose. Didn't want anyone seeing her vitals. Shame she couldn't use her favorite invention. She did all that to keep me and our daughter safe.
sis? I can hear you. We're whole again. We're one. Like before in the womb. Remember? Lincoln. Akna. Thanks to you, Edge Not City is finally within reach. And you, Lachna. Your work will help ensure that the Cairo network remains online. Together, we might just make it all. Now then, Sam. We've been studying the data from when you claim you encountered. We had audio, which doesn't paint a complete... The languages, the names, and terms we picked out. The munitions we could identify. Everything seems to indicate that you were on a battlefield over a hundred years ago. World War I, to be precise. It wasn't a dream. Wasn't a hallucination. Maybe you were spirited away to another dimension or something. Given the time discrepancies, maybe you were sent to a beach. Can't say anything for certain. That said, I, I've never heard of a beach turned into a battlefield. But beaches are shaped by the will of the people who inhabit them. Perhaps Hartman can offer a more rational explanation. Beaches are his specialty. Unfortunately, he's still outside the Cairo network. Anyway, get some rest. No use dwelling on questions we can't answer yet. Your work is greatly... Good morning, Sam. Blood collection complete. Thank you for your generosity. Sam, we've received a delivery request from the Timefall Farm. And I'm told you can expect a special reward if you do an especially good job. You should drop by the farm and review the details for yourself. Looking for this? Surprise! Fragile warped me here. I finally got to visit the beach. Well, her beach. Don't worry, I didn't come all this way for the sightseeing. Your beloved BB has a serious issue. Call me explaining that these incubators connect BBs via the chiral network to their still mothers back at HQ. Bridge babies are quite literally bridges between this world and the other side. Their place is not here with us, nor with the BTs over there. They belong precisely in between, with no greater affinity for one world or the other. 
but BB-28 here has been leaning further and further towards the world of the living. Towards you, sir. It's because we're partners. <laughs> partners? Sam, a BB's a tool, not a human being. Bridge, yes. Baby, no. So tell me what the problem is. This tool, this weapon, is transforming into a living being. It's gaining weight. Its brain activity is increasing. It's accumulating memories. BB-28 is becoming self-aware, becoming an actual child. Doesn't sound like a problem to me. It's hardware, Sam. Manufactured for a purpose. A purpose that cannot fulfill outside the pot. There is a...